Question, how does the burly old walrus help make an automobile? Well, his hide is used to make friction drives for coil winding machines. A recent survey of General Motors suppliers reveals that in addition to the walrus hide, they're now buying parts, materials, and services from 26,000 other companies, most of them small businesses. Sometimes the products are unique and unexpected. For example, what do you suppose in this scene is supplied GM? Why, baby's bottle nipple for masking out parts in painting operations. And at the end of the assembly line, a baby's soft diaper for polishing. And guess what else? The Troubadour's guitar pick for coil winding and electrical parts. Very important also is Milady's golf glove for protection in lacing and tying wiring. Besides the obvious requirements like steel, rubber, and glass, here's more of the unusual. All in all, GM spends nearly 50 cents of every dollar it takes in with suppliers in every state. 86% of these suppliers have fewer than 500 employees, and 59% have fewer than 100 employees. Another quiz game. What do you see here that helps make a car? Extraordinary, but ground walnut shells are used for deburring metal. Also, cactus fibers for use on air cleaners. The pipe cleaner for cleaning small holes in parts. And ground corn cobs for drying and polishing metal. Roller skates and bicycles for getting around in large plants. And for use in air cleaners, a filtering material is obtained from a certain part about Bossy. And that's the end of this tale.